filming? This is going to be a mega stunt. You sure you're filming? I'm filming. Like, seriously, do it already. You are going to be drowning in lights. Want to bet? Exclusive offer, super spray. Spray it and forget it. Spray it and forget it? What does that even mean? A hole, a crack, a breach. Just spray our miracle product and everything will be as good as new. Hey, we need one. this hard if there's super spray. <laughs> Attention, dear Toastians. Something strange is happening in the city. Rainfall on the city's outskirts causes objects to fall apart. It's all because of super spray. Nearly everyone has used it. If the whole town gets rained on, then Toastville. Maya, Nick, B and Bo, Muffy and Sonia. Sonia from Toastville. Romeo and Juliet. Hello, Toastville fans. So guess what? We had auditions for the school play last week. But then again, when I decided to audition, I had no idea that the real drama would unfold in Toastville. Romeo, wherefore art thou? Romeo? Oh, hi there, Mom, Dad. Could you help me learn my lines? It's kind of weird how the people in this Shakespeare play talk. Well, Sonia, that is the way people used to talk. We're just heading out for a coffee now. Bye. Maybe your toast friends can help with something like this. <laughs> uh, it's Toastians, Dad. That's a really good idea. Toastville time for Sonia. Hello, Maya. Sonia. Hello. Great timing. Do you know anything about first dates? I'm making a video. First date survival guide. I've got so many ideas. Where do I start? Oh, how about you and I try to help each other? Actually, I'm auditioning for a school play all about dating. It's called Romeo and Juliet. It's about two teens who fall in love. Their families hate each other and won't let them date. Oh, wow. That sounds just like Comeo and Blackliet. Is that the name of some Toastian play? Nah, Comeo is a Toastian. And here's what recently happened to him. He was reading romantic poetry when he heard music. It was a crumble named Uletti and his daughter, Blotliet. Crumbles and Toastians singing they twirl, each of them at the end of the world. Their hearts are wounded in terrible pain. They are separated by the cheese membrane. Blotliet. You are the loveliest crumble I have ever seen. And you, Gomeo, are the handsomest Toastian I've ever seen. Crumble's in oh. town. What is going on here? They ruin everything. No, dear Toastians. We come with songs of friendship and peace. We're not so different after all. Don't you think? Crumble's ruin everything. everything. Crumble's ruin everything. everything. It's time to call the cops. Dad, <laughs> you've got to do something. That's why I'm here, son. Oh, oh no, no, it's Mr. Uletti who needs help. They came here in peace. Crumbles ruin everything. Crumbles ruin everything. No matter what they came here with, it is illegal for them to be here without visas. Hey, you, miss, come over here. <gasps> you, troublemaker. Step back, Toastian. Could you let me through, please? I must get to the burnt lands to see my Blotliet. If you want to move across Checkpoint Cheese, you're going to need a visa issued by the mayor. <laughs> and he's been sitting on that bench ever since. That is so sad. We cannot let a love like this die. Come on, we've got to go help them. <laughs> 
<laughs> Romeo, don't be blue. We are here to reunite you with your lost love. As if. The mayor will not give me a visa because all Toastians hate all crumbles. Hmm. You can leave that to me. Just put these on and follow my lead. Step back, Toastians. <clears throat> we were sent here to restore an exploded pipe at the cheese membrane, so you'd better let us in quick. I haven't received any instructions related to that. And if your checkpoint gets flooded with sewage, are you ready to go to court? Gets flooded? To court? Well, fine then. Stay still! Son, come here! Oh no, that is my father! <laughs> and you are under house arrest! Again. It seems like we need a new plan. Oh, Crumbles! What do we do now? Well then, let's pretend we are Crumbles! Ahem. The elevator is broken and won't work again until we get the right parts. Uh, where did you even come from? Uh... Yeah? Oh, I hear a harp and crying. I think Lothliet is over there. Lothliet, it's okay. We are here to reunite you with Comeo. Wherefore art thou, Comeo? Oh, wow, it's just like in the play. He loves you a lot. We'll show you the way to him, cool? I really love him too, but I can't even look at him when my father is locked up in Toastville's horrible prison. This is going to be way harder than I thought. Uh. Getting the parts! This will just take a minute! <laughs> Crumbles! <laughs> Stay still! Uh, wait, 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 wait! It's us! We just need to get a tool! We'll be right back! This is the last chance! If Inspector Monty can't resolve the issue, Comeo and Plotly, it will never be a couple! Oh, bless you, Toast, you came! My boy won't eat or sleep. He claims he suffers from a broken heart. I'll do whatever it takes to help him. Oh, I'll even let that crumble you let he go. This is a fantastic idea. Oh, and by the way, we need to speak to the mayor. So for this reason, Inspector Monty will let you let he go. Now, bluntly, it still needs a crumble visa. You are expecting too much, Sonia. Toastians and Crumbles have been at war with each other forever. But since a Crumble and a Toastian can fall head over heels in love, what if the burnt lands and the light side were also capable of living in peace and harmony? Just imagine, you will be the one who has made the peace possible. You go down in history as the greatest mayor of all time! I will? I have decided to support the idea of Uledi's release. But the Crumble Mayor has to issue Bloodliet's visa, and he's got a heart of stone. Maybe try talking to him like a real diplomat. Hello. Hello. This is the Mayor of Toastville. It's about this Bloodliet of yours. Well, back at you, you piece of burnt bread. Let me, give me a... Uh, mayor, sir, this is Sonia speaking. Sonia from Toastville? Do you remember those Shakespeare lines? My bounty is as boundless as the sea. My love as deep. The more I give to thee, the more I have. For both are infinite. It is beautiful, isn't it? Oh. Oh, uh, oh, it's okay. Come on, don't cry, Mayor, sir. Uh, here's what you need to do. Greetings. Greetings. Bloodly head. Daddy! Will you go on a date with me? Definitely. And what do you think we should do? Oh, I got a whole list of ideas for what to do on your first date. First, an unforgettable romantic walk. Flowers for you. The one who blooms in my heart. Wow, well, these are big. <laughs> Maybe you're allergic to flowers. Then a picnic with delicacies of deep fried cockroach eggs. They're my favorite of all time. Huh? <laughs> 
Why do you sing? This singing's making me nauseous. Let me remind you that's my dad. And your poetry sounds like something a fish would write. Awful, terrible date. Daddy! It's all because no, of you. No, you. No, you. It's all because you're a crow. No, it's all because you're a toastian. Drama queen! You wuss! Oh, these two? We helped reconcile two countries at war, only for them to fall apart over nothing and ruin everything. And what about your play? Does it end the same way? I have no idea. Honestly, I didn't finish it. I better go do that now. Home time for Sonia. don't happen because one person is a Toastian and the other is a Crumble, but because they don't know how to be a friend. Eventually, I decided not to audition for that play. Do you know what happens at the end? Romeo and Juliet die for love. <laughs> Seriously? Who would even write that? Not cool, Mr. Shakespeare. No likes from me. And to respond to Alexander from Haifa, Crumble music is pretty good, but not as good as the Happy Stones. <laughs> I'm out. See ya. Bye-bye. here. The other day, I got another F in geography. How am I supposed to remember the capitals of England, France, Italy, and on and on? There's so many of them, and I haven't been to a single one. But I hear in Toastville, there's this Smart Z app. It does homework for you and uploads the info right into your brain. So I decided to try it. Toastville, time for Sonia. <laughs> <laughs> Sonia! Didn't realize it was so late here in Toastville. It's daytime, Sonia. B and I were playing video games, then the power went out. What do we do now? Whoa! Hey, we can use the SmartZ app. It could help us get the power back on. Can we download it? Oh, yeah. I forgot my phone won't work here in Toastville. Let me look at it. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Greetings! Whoa. I'm Mr. Smart. Whoa, whoa! Hey there, Mr. Smart! I'm Sonia! Hello! Hello. And we are... B and Bo. Whoa. Yes, I know everything there is to know. And now, you can be smart too. We'll turn Toastville into Smartsyville. Really? How? Ask me anything you can think of. I'm here to help you. Okay. Do you know how to turn the power back on? One moment. Ah! Oh. Ooh. Is it for us? Thank you. <laughs> Voila! Thank you, Mr. Smart. Oh, it was really nothing. Always ask me. So, just tell me, do you agree? And... We agree! Excellent, because helping all Toastians is my core program. Maya, I'm coming over with Mr. Smart. He's so full of useful information. Yeah? Can you ask him to tell me which bracelet looks better? These two are totally useless here. Hmm, here's a little tip for you. Try combining some contrasting colors. Trust me. Hmm? Ah, beautiful! I like a spicy Thai chili fried egg. <laughs> it is so important to be a fashionista. Do you agree? I agree. You see, Mr. Smart makes everyone smarter. So we'll be there soon. Wait, maybe not so soon. That will take at least an hour. Uh. I can show you a quick detour. Do you agree? I agree. Yeah. Hi, guys, what's up? 
This is Mr. Smart, and this is... Nick and Muffy. Oh, I'm so happy to meet you. Would either of you like to ask me anything? Yes, I would, but in private. Uh, I wanted to ask, uh, so, well, how do I compliment, um, a girl? Aha! Simply walk up to her and say, you look unbelievable today. You look unbelievable today. Just so. I mean, who could resist you? Do you agree? I agree. Huh? Oh. Why are you crying? Ah, I see he doesn't want to give back your toy. You could offer to trade with him. That's wonderful! You know how to find the right approach with children. You have to share your skills with others. I would be extremely happy to do that. Maya, I really just wanted to tell you that you look, uh, unbearable. What? Oh, that wasn't it. You look unseemly. What are you saying, Muffy? I... I don't know. Mr. Smart gave me a good compliment to say. Oh, but I can't remember the words without him. What's this on my wrist? What's going on? You bought it for yourself after Mr. Smart told you to. Wait, he told me to? I... I don't remember that at all. Look, something's not right here, so maybe we should ask Mr. Smart. Oh, where'd he go? So, Mr. Smart, we could say that your knowledge is literally limitless. Absolutely. And that is precisely how and why I can help you to solve any problem. Oh. Simply entrust me with your toasty and brains to help me turn Toastville into Smartsyville. So then, do you agree? Yes? Yeah? We agree! <laughs> and now it's time for the weather report. Tomorrow you'll see cotton candy fog throughout the city and some precipitation in the form of ice cream. Uh, no, that's not it. Uh, I forgot the weather. Play something quick! Me, me, mama, mumia. Blistering backbeats! Can anyone remember how to play music? Looks like something's wrong with everyone in Toastville. Did you notice? It's totally fine. Mr. Smart is so glad. He knows everything for us. Uh... He said we'll turn Toastville into Smartsyville. <gasps> he wants to take over Toasty and Mines. How did I not see it right away? Stop watching this. Oh no, not again. We need Mr. Smart. Uh, fire! Everyone out right now! I quickly realized that after bringing it to Toastville, my cute little smartphone turned into a real monster with internet search engine level ambitions. Oh, what? I stepped on the brakes. Or was it the gas? I forget everything. I need Mr. Smart. <laughs> Do you remember what to do with this? We need Mr. Smart! Excuse me, but why is his mouth open? I don't know. Maybe he's hungry? Uh, what is this white thing in his mouth? White plane, turn left. Blue plane, right. Oh, which way is left? Er, right? Can someone please ask Mr. Smart for me? Friends, I am thrilled to make this important announcement. I appoint myself Mayor of Toastville. <laughs> Thank you. And here is my first decree. Get out your smartphones. Now, lift them up. And smash them on the ground. 
Congratulations! You are now free from the burden of knowledge. Anything you need to know, just ask me. Oh, great and powerful Mr. Smart! Who dares to mock me? Our wise and all-knowing Mr. Smart! We are all grateful for your gift, allowing us to clear out our toasty and minds! Mr. Smart, oh, let me embrace you! Really? <laughs> Fine. Come here, my dear, brainless little one. See, your plan was quite good, but boy, is mine so much better. Crusters, you really are truly free now! Maya, you... You just look so amazing. Oh, Muffy, thanks. <laughs> oh, wow! It looks like everything is back to normal. Now it's home time for Sonia. <laughs> Using smartphones is okay, but not to think for you. Yeah, to make a long story short, I see now that it's better to memorize things for yourself. So I put up these posters with the most prominent landmarks. And for Paul from North Bay. I'll be visiting one of these places soon. Can you guess which one? <laughs> I'm out. See ya. Bye-bye. I just grow to feel any pain. Only wind you pull in my brain. Price you pay! Hey gang, it's Sonia here. Today I needed to get a present for a friend, which became a way bigger challenge than expected. No, no, I'm not sure he likes this kind of stuff. It's the first birthday present I've given Muffy. It's a big deal, so it has to be special. Toast fill time for Sonia! Coastville Shopping Center. You can find almost anything there. Hey there, you two. You shopping for Muffy's present? Hey there, Sonia. We are. Oh, my toast. I've already found mine. And it's the coolest present ever. Ta-da! <gasps> Catch them quickly! <laughs> I thought you wanted those to record videos from a bird's eye view, right? Uh, yeah. I was hoping he'd, you know, lend them to me. We found nothing at all. We can't think of anything. Then let's work together to find something. Oh, we don't want Muffy to see. Oh, uh, don't worry about that. Nick's got his full attention. Hey, you ready for some Banana Borders Extreme Action Sports? Jump in, it's showtime! <laughs> uh, it's been over an hour and we found nothing we might like. Hmm. Ooh, what about this cool hat? Nothing well, doesn't, you know, wear hats. Hey, put me down this instant. I sell hats. I'm not for sale, I'll have Oops, you know. Oops, I'm really sorry. Outrageous. <laughs> Why do people keep putting me on? Birthday shopping is exhausting. Hey, hey! <gasps> Need something special? I've got the most unique, memorable presents in Toastville right here today, right now! Oh, look at those! What's in the boxes? These are miracle boxes! Each one has the most amazing, astounding, stupendous surprise inside! Cool, how about a stone that turns into a flower? <laughs> into a flower, a flower pot, or even a 50-foot yacht if you want! Oh, how about never-ending scoops of ice cream with fudge on top? With fudge on top, a chocolate drop, and a wet, smelly mop, too. <laughs> Anything you like. You never know what you'll find in a miracle box. Ooh, I don't know. Sounds a bit fishy to me. I will take one. A payment first, okay? Sure thing. How much for it? Oh, not much. Nothing too costly. 
One teensy little bit of meanness. No meanness? You bet. Just a tiny bit. A practical joke, if you like. And the box is yours. Oh, if it's only a joke. I don't like this. Of course you don't. You already got a present. Hmm. Uh, it's so hot today. <gasps> oh, this will cool you down. Oh, thank <laughs> you. <gasps> <laughs> Each joke adds dough and stacks of boxes grow. Uh -huh. <laughs> see? Easy as one, two, three. Now let's see. <laughs> it's a Happy Stones ball cap. I've wanted one forever. You see? Just one joke with a little bit of meanness. Oh. <laughs> uh, can I have some shampoo, please and thanks? <laughs> when someone's acting mean, my bag is full of green. <laughs> that was really so mean of you two. I mean, really good job. Here you go. Oh, it's Crumble Crush! The new game he wants so badly. <laughs> yes, only a tiny bit of meanness can lead to so much joy. Oh, well, I guess if it brings happiness, it can be a good thing. Yep, you should try it. Oh, I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. This kid's meanness adds some extra greenness. So much meanness delivered with such a smile deserves a special reward. They're not even officially released in stores yet. Ah. Oh, hey, you guys, we still haven't found a present for Muffy. How about this one here? No, 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 no. You have to be super mean to get this super fabulous box. <laughs> Not bad. And how about a bigger box? You'll have to come up with a way more extreme mean joke to get it. Hang on a minute. What about our very own pro prankster? <laughs> and then I do a kickflip. Look, check it out. <laughs> so rad. Nick isn't answering. If Nick won't come to the phone, then we gotta go to Nick. Be right back. <laughs> What's up, Sonia? Did you find a present? Yes, and it's the best one ever. But to get it for him, we have to do a super seriously mean joke. Got it? Uh, like a really naughty prank. Oh, okay. You came to the right place. One sec. Muffy, I just gotta go to the park. And give me the last balloon. <laughs> a genius at work. Right, all done. I thought up this prank ages ago, but I was saving it for a special occasion. Someone just has to sit on the bench and... <laughs> huh? Nick? Nick, where are you? I think he said something about the park. But I was saving it for a special occasion. Someone just has to sit on the bench and... <laughs> Oh, excellent, very good. When it works, you'll get your big box at once. Guys, I'm getting us all Sparkle Splash sodas to celebrate getting Muffy's gift with a seriously cool and brilliant joke on someone else. <laughs> Thank you. Uh -huh. Sparkle Splash soda is my fave. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> a really mean outcome is my best source of income. Wonderful. An oldie but a goodie. <laughs> wasn't part of the deal. <laughs> Not with you it wasn't, but with them it was. <laughs> Don't take it personally. It's just that meanness is my whole business. Here, have a towel. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Here you go, my friend. 
When someone plays a prank on you, it's not very cool at all. Yeah, no more mean tricks, please. Yes! Uh, guys, we've still got one more mean old trick left, remember? The park! Uh, where's she got to? <laughs> oh, the Munch Muffin! No! What? Grab him! Look at me! He's flying away! Uh, guys, help! Get me down from here! This wasn't a very good way of getting a present! Present? Oh, that's it! Maya, give me your present! Present? Why, see you? <gasps> of course! make the best presents. <laughs> and that was enough experience to last me a lifetime. <laughs> thanks for saving me. And Nick, thanks for not playing any of your pranks on me today. <laughs> no probs. Hey, how about a party? Hey, hey, what a sweet deal. <laughs> oh, 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 what unexpected meanness. <laughs> Muffy, that was a great party. I'm off now. Bye, guys. Bye, bye. bye. Home time for Sonia. You can't make someone happy at the expense of someone else's unhappiness, even as a joke or prank. And so that was how the day ended. Yes, Yuri from Toronto, I've still got the Happy Stones ball cap, but no, I'm not going to sell it. Sorry. <laughs> I'm out. See you. Bye-bye. Freedom and conscience, reasons to say. Friendship and goodness are the price you pay. Childhood and fondness, music to play. Comfort and quiet are the price you pay. Last jam! Hey gang, it's me, Sonia. Sometimes I help my dad out at the cafe. I know, I should have listened to him more, but I was in a big hurry to get to Toastville earlier today, and inventory is so boring. There's eight bottles, Sonia. We need to be accurate when counting inventory so we don't run out. Our street's full of stores. If we run out of stuff, we can just buy more. Ah, uh, as Grandma always said, life can be pretty unpredictable, so it's good to be prepared for anything, you know? Seven. <sighs> okay, we're almost done here, so go play. Oh, yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Maya needed my help shooting a new kind of influencer video. Oh, no! It's my last drop of pink jam. Better get more while I'm out there today. Toastville time for Sonia! Video. The deal, Sonia, is that I'm done with the usual influencer stuff, like food pics and makeup tutorials. I want to try something new. Ooh, oh yeah. So what's it all about? Ooh, adventure. I heard there's a fortune-telling rainbow in Rainbow Haven, and I want to be the first Toastian to cover a prediction. Great idea. But before, let's stop at Mr. Lee to shop for some more pink jam. First, no Toastians will ever watch my channel. I get it, this won't take long. Hey there, Mr. Lee Chu, it's me, Sona. Oh. oh! Did someone rob this place? Oh no, that looks like his shoe. Was Mr. Lee Chu kidnapped? Maybe he ran out of cleaning supplies and went to get some more. 
Ah, uh, yeah, we should really leave or we'll miss the last bus to Rainbow Haven. <laughs> Hang on, let me scrape up a bit of jam. Oh. Ew, that smells like it's going bad. It'll have to do for now. Magnets look like places in Toast Land. Hey, this looks like Rainbow Haven. We just need more jam. Sonia, it's turned black. That can't be good. Mm. Your friend is right. Black jam is unpredictable. Well, uh, thanks. So, um, yeah, who are you? A friend. And if the jam is spoiled, then the navigation magnets won't work the way you expect them to. See, uh, my parents told me never to talk to strangers. Uh, so... Uh, Rainbow Haven time for Sonia and Maya! Sonia, we crossed the cheese membrane to the burnt lens of Toastland. This is not the adventure I had in mind today. Jam. Our team of doom stainers are ready to sneak into Toastville and splatter black ooze all over the town. But you know, I'm not used to cooking in someone else's kitchen. Just make it quick, see? Or it's the walking toilet for you, bub. Oh no, anything but that. <laughs> you gotta stop this quick. So we need a plan. Actually, spoiled jam's unpredictable properties may come in handy here, you know. Here's what I know. I might actually trust you more if you told us who you are and why you're following us. I'll explain later. But right now, Sonia, you're the only ones who can stop this. Oh, uh, do I know you? I didn't expect that. Life can be pretty unpredictable. So it's good to be prepared for anything, you know? That sounds really familiar. By adding black jam to the Crumbles pot, you can foil their plan for oh, good. Okay, I'll give it a go. Maya, distract the Crumbles. How? The second they see me, they'll arrest me for being a Toastian. Just see an old Crumble for a bit. And how do you know my name? Oh, and she's gone again. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> you there! Can I take a photo of you very important crumbles? What? Uh, whatever for. What are you, some sort of crumble reporter? Um, yes. Hi, that's me. I'm the new reporter with the contemporary, um, uh, crumble cuisine, you know. I absolutely must get a photo of you and your delightful new recipe. Mm. Smile! <laughs> <laughs> Huh? It's me, Sonia. We're getting out of here. Sonia, thank you. But I can't leave this whole pot of pink jam here. The crumbles could use it to teleport to the light side. Oh, that jam is spoiled. It sure is. And it'll spoil their plans. from contemporary crumble cuisine? You're a meddling toastian. And what are you doing over there? Grab them! What in the black ooze are you doing here? Tell them that it's ready now. Uh, the girls were just helping me in the kitchen, and uh, here, it's ready now. 
It smells pretty strange. Are uh, you sure? It smells fine. You need to blow your nose. Give me that. Uh, Toastville, time for crumbles. Shop time for Mr. Lee Too and friends. <laughs> yeah, I have a lot of cleaning up to do. Maya, I almost forgot the fortune telling rainbow. <sighs> Too late. We'll never beat the others there. There is. Fortunately, those crumbles didn't find my secret, secret supply. <laughs> Rolling! Here's my prediction that you, Maya the Influencer, will have untold amazing adventures with your best friend! Oh, what a brilliant prediction! Who would have thought it? And cut on the first ever rainbow prediction video. Sonia, thank you! I knew you would never let me down. Oh! And here's my bus home. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye, <laughs> Maya. <sighs> home time for Sonia. As Graham always said, life can be pretty unpredictable, so it's good to be prepared for anything, you know? So now I always check my jam inventory to avoid getting into a jam. But still, it's strange. Why did that mysterious someone quote my grandma? Ah, and to Futi from Gabaron who asked what the black jam tastes like, well, you do not want to know. I'm out. So long. Bye-bye. Black jam. gets pimples, your friends don't care what you look like. They love you just the way you are. Oh, why do bad pimples happen to good people? Hey, I know who can help me. Toastville time for Sonia. I'm trying to get old Nick there to notice me. Hey, Nick, what's up? Huh? Hey, check it! <laughs> but he totally doesn't get it! That new makeup could help you catch his eye and to help me cover up this massively disgusting, enormous zit. Come on. And we've got something that'll help, too. <laughs> Hiding makeup for me will be a breeze. You have a zit? Look, oh, you can barely see it. You what? No, it's ginormous. Oh, I really need to get some good makeup. Okay, let's find something. Hey, hey, 
check out the amazing cool powder. Everything that's ugly and ignored instantly looks pretty. I guarantee it. Oh, that's perfect. We'll just press the buy now button. This cool powder should make my gross ginormous ugly to disappear. stage crew? <gasps> you betcha! How can I help? You can join the crew setting up our concert. And this is our massive, cool special effect. Wow! Yeah, and if you do a good enough job, we might let you join our cool band, too. Just raise and rotate this puff above everyone! Awesome! Your concert's gonna blow toast fill mine! <laughs> <laughs> you know it. You got that? <laughs> Once Toastville's puffed with enough of our cool powder, they'll see our wrecking crew as artists redecorating the town instead of trashing it. <laughs> hey, Toastville, are you ready to rock? I said, are you ready to rock? Let's run! Nick! He's over there on the train! 
Meddling Toast Savior ruined everything for us! I know, but we'll get our revenge. Get him! Please! Go away! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. I'm really, really sorry, guys. Everything looked so amazing and awesome and cool. I couldn't stop myself. Don't feel so bad, Nick. It's our fault for using the cool powder on you in the first place. Yes. See ya. I just wanted to look good in your eyes. Hey, you always look good, Maya. I do? Yeah. So, um, <clears throat> we should probably clean up Toastville, don't you think? Did you hear that? Oh, my Nikki says I always look good. Oh, trust me, my bestie. Nick's right. Uh, well, I hope you can manage to clean up without me. Ha! <sighs> Home time for Sonia. It's so much better for you to see things as they are, you know, rather than what they seem to be. And after all these terrible events, my pimples seem to be just a teeny tiny little problem. A day later, it was gone. And to Olga from Oslo. Crumble's singing sound like a variegated chabara that got its tail caught in a blender. <laughs> I'm out, see ya, bye bye Controlled evolution. Hey, Toast fans. I spent a long time in front of the mirror recently, and I stopped loving what I saw there. So it got me thinking about how to improve myself. Until that is, B and Bo gave me a call. On this shell phone thingy they gave me, they said their uncle too invented it. Some serious cheering up, and banana chips are the most cheerful snack there is. Toastville time for Sonia. Chewed gum. Here, have a banana chip. They always cheer me up. Gross. Only boiled onions can cheer me up, but I doubt they will. Mm, okay, we can all make you some. Forget it. I'm so clumsy, I'd probably ruin the onions too. <laughs> Do you know why Muffy is so down? Oh, he knocked over a big shelf of soda pop in the store yesterday. <gasps> <laughs> I'm so clumsy that no one will ever love me. Oh, why did I 
have to be born an awkward muffin and not like a beautiful, graceful bird. Oh, Muffy really needs our help. Oh, I've got an idea. Hey, didn't you just tell me your uncle, too, invented an evolutionator? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. Hey, Muffy, should I evolutionate up some boiled onions for you? Mm -hmm. Uncle Two's lab is really cool. Is that the evolutionator over there? Yes. So any object can be put through a series of changes to turn into something new. Yeah, Uncle Two calls it nearly controlled evolution. Wait, so why nearly? Because the result is so unstable. See this garlic? Look at it change. Let's turn it into an orange, for example. Now we enter the command for evolve in the emitter. <gasps> Fascinating, so fresh. Mm. Mm -hmm. Tastes like an orange. Oh, it turned back to garlic. See, we told you the results were so unstable. Yeah, you have to eat it quickly before it returns to its original state. Ah, uh, we'll make it work. I promised you boiled onions, Muffy, so here goes. That's the only reason I came. Right, here's the boiled onion. The chain is formed and evolved! <laughs> Oh, here's your onion. Oh, this is the best boiled onion I've ever had. Wow, can I have another go? I'll evolve this shoe into ice cream. Evolutionate! <laughs> It's still experimental. It could malfunction sometimes. Oh, but now we've got a lovely vase. Muffy, fill it with nice flowers and give it to Maya to apologize for spraying her with soda yesterday. Oh, I don't know. It's no use. I'm such a clumsy clutch, really. Who could love me? Who could want me? Oh, wait. If it's possible to improve things with this, why not use it on Muffy to make him better? I don't think that'll work. Well, I sure do. I'll do anything to stop being so clumsy. Huh, so you want to be a bird for real then? You could try it since it's temporary. I've set the final stage at Seagull. The important thing is to not get stuck midway. Launching the evolution process. Oh, wow! Whoa. Look, Muffy, seriously, now you've got wings! A few more steps in! Oh, no, he's stuck at the fly stage! Ah. Oh. No, uh, okay, we'll fix it! Oh, no, why? Why me? Muffy, don't panic, just give us a second to reboot it! Oh, what is that lovely stench? Nasty, disgusting smell that I clearly deserve. Muffy, stop! It's working again! We can finish your evolution! No! I'm such a disgusting fly, forget it! I belong on the burnt lands in the land of once-eaten cheeses. Muffy, wait! I'm gonna need wings to catch him. Sonia, you sure? It's too... Risky? No kidding. Hit it, dude. <laughs> oh, it's so heavy. Well, I'll just have to bring Muffy to it. Oh, so gross. 
course. And delicious. Muffy, please come back. We all love you just the way you are. Yeah, well, whatever. Pass me that piece of cheese over there. We gotta hurry. If the evolutionator shorts out for good, we'll both be stuck as flies forever. Maybe I want to be a fly forever. That's all I deserve now. when you are you. Good advice there, Muffy. You should tell yourself that more often. Home time for Sonya Fly. Uh, home time for Sonya. <gasps> See you, Toastians. Oh. That means you're cool after all, Muffy. Only a cool Muffin can have such a cool friend as Sonia. Yeah, that's so right. Mmm. <laughs> it's not worth improving on something that's already pretty well made, that's for sure. <laughs> After all that evolution, Pretty happy to be the way I am. And to Hugo from Berlin? <laughs> yeah, ever since I came back, I'm so craving that stinky cheese. <laughs> hmm. I'm out. See ya. Bye bye. <laughs>